in the last game we managed to escape with a win in the last three seconds of the game welcome back to my dylan gabriel heisman challenge where i'm attempting to win a heisman in his first season here at oklahoma but i'm starting to think it may not happen but we do have a second year of eligibility that i can use i've already practiced this week like usual but we are going to go in here and take deep ball to up our throw accuracy and our throw power now up to a 95 overall also with coach stress i am now able to call hot routes at home games which is helpful since today we are in norman the goal for today is to not throw three interceptions i've done it in the last two games hoping to kind of break that streak today first and 10 out of shotgun and a screen pass out to theo weiss does the blocking set up he gets to the outside and weiss with the first down on the next play we're out in shotgun again we're going to hand this ball to marcus major right up the middle and major with a three yard gain second and seven out of shotgun we will take the snap and we're going to drake stoops who is wide open for the catch and the first down across the 50 yard line first and 10 gabriel out of shotgun we will take the snap and i was looking to go deep there to drake stoops maybe but we'll take off with gabriel and get about an eight yard gain second and two out of shotgun with eric gray in the backfield that's where we'll hand it and he goes way too far to the outside breaks a tackle and loses a yard had he read the proper hole there that's probably a first down but now third and three and coach has called four verticals so we're sending everybody deep we will take the snap and we're going deep down the right side to a wide open marvin mims and he is gone touchdown oklahoma on our first drive from 42 yards out first and 10 out of shotgun still up seven nothing on the next drive We'll come out and take that throw over the middle to a wide open Jaleel Farouk, and he's off to the races, but caught after a 30-yard play. First and 10, Gabriel out of shotgun. We'll take the snap, and we're going to throw that under. Never mind. All right, almost through my first pick. I was looking for the safe throw. was not expecting that DB to be that far under. Now second and 10, and it's a speed option. We will take that pitch out to Eric Gray, and Gray to the outside gets a four-yard gain. Now third and six, looking to keep the drive moving. Out of shotgun, we'll take the snap and a quick throw to Marvin Mims over the middle for the first down. Breaking tackles brought down to the 15. First and 10 out of shotgun again. Gabriel will take the snap. And we're going to Drake Stoops over the middle who makes the catch, cuts back, and is down at the one-yard line. I thought he was in. First and goal out of shotgun. Gabriel will take the snap. We're going back to Drake Stoops who makes the catch. Touchdown Oklahoma, and we are up 14-0 here in the first. We get the ball back, and it's still 14-0 now in the second quarter, and we will take that throw to Drake Stoops, who is wide open for the first down. First and 10 out of shotgun. Gabriel will take the snap, and we're going to go deep for Drake Stoops. I think he has a step on his man. No, he does not. Incomplete. All right, at least we didn't throw a pick. Now second and 10. Take the snap, and roll to the left side. Looking downfield. We'll stop, and we're throwing deep to a wide open Farouk, who is into the end zone. Touchdown, Oklahoma. That is three passing touchdowns in the first half. We come back out still 21 to nothing. As the defense is playing amazing today, we will throw this underneath to Gray, who will make the catch and get a gain of eight. And now Coach is sending everybody deep here on second and two. So let's see if anyone wants to come open deep downfield. I'm not really seeing it. I tried to take off. That's definitely a horse collar tackle for a loss of six. Third and eight, Gabriel out of shotgun. We will take the snap. And we're gonna go deep down the left side for Marvin Mims who will make the catch and he is gone. Touchdown, Oklahoma, 28 to nothing as long as our kicker doesn't miss the extra point. I don't think this TCU team was prepared very well. 28 to nothing here. We'll take the snap and step up in the pocket trying to run and we'll get a two yard gain. We fumbled the ball, but I think OU recovered. Okay, three yard gain. Out of shotgun one more time. Gabriel will take the snap. And we will take that throw to the outside to a wide open Mims who makes the catch and gets out of bounds. First and 10, Gabriel out of shotgun will take the snap and looking deep downfield, but we will dump this off to Stoops who still has the first down and a gain of 22. First and 10, Gabriel out of shotgun will take the snap. And we're looking to go deep because everyone called four verticals again. We fumble the ball for the second straight time or the second time on this drive, but once again, we recover. Clock is ticking, 30 seconds to go here in the half. Out of shotgun, we'll take the snap and we'll take that throw out to Marvin Mims on the outside who makes the catch, breaks the tackle and is brought down. First and goal, 14 seconds to go. We take the snap and we're going to Farouk in the end zone. Five passing touchdowns in the first half today. We come back out to start the second half up 35 to nothing out of shotgun. We'll take the snap and we'll take that throw to Weiss who drops it. And now they want to run this uh, QB draw that we ran one time last week. Let's see if it goes any better today. And we get a gain of about four. I lied. It was a gain of five, but it does not really matter. Now third and five out of shotgun. 
We'll take the snap, and we're going to take that throw to Farouk, who makes the catch, and his defender dove trying to make a play. So Farouk is off to the races, and I think he will get caught, and he will, but he gets a gain of 49. First and 10, Gabriel will take the snap, and we will stand back in the pocket. Never mind, I don't know why I said in the pocket, but we'll dump it up to Parker, who runs over a man for a four-yard gain. I said I was standing in the pocket on that last play as I was dropping to my right side. Now second and six, Gabriel out of shotgun will take the snap and will throw over the middle, caught by Mims for a first down. First and 10 out of shotgun. Gabriel will take the snap and we'll roll out to the left side. We're gonna throw this one away. I apparently still don't know my rights or my lefts because I said rolling out to the left side and that was definitely the right side. Now second and 10, Gabriel out of shotgun. We will give this one to Eric Gray. We have not ran the ball a whole lot today and Gray gets a two yard gain. Third and eight, Gabriel in shotgun. We will take the snap and we're gonna go to Theo Weiss and that's knocked out of the air. That would have been our sixth touchdown today. But our kicker does make the field goal. So that makes it 38 nothing and the defense keeps the shutout alive. So we will come out and throw this one out to Eric Gray on the outside who will get a gain of six. Gabriel out in shotgun. We are now over 400 yards passing today. And Stoops is coming wide open over the middle for the first down and a 27 yard play. First and 10 from Shotgun will take the snap, hand off to Gray, and that's blown up in the backfield. Second and 13 out of Shotgun, will hand it to Eric Gray again. Gray up the middle, gets positive yards this time, and sets up a third and three. Out of Shotgun, Gabriel will take the snap. Looking to go downfield, and we're going to a wide open Stoops, who makes the catch inside the 20, and he's over 100 receiving yards today. First and 10 out of Shotgun. We'll take the snap, and we're going to Braden Willis in the end zone. Touchdown, Oklahoma. That is our sixth passing touchdown, and we are up 44 to nothing, most likely 45 to nothing. Final score would be 45 to 7. The backups did let up a touchdown to TCU, but we absolutely dominated today. I think we only had like five incomplete passes and six touchdown passes. Hopefully that will put us in the Heisman race a little bit. Dylan Gabriel finishes today 22 of 27 for 462 yards and six touchdowns. Just domination today. Didn't do anything on the ground, but through the air, we had three receivers go over 100 yards. Tubes got 127 and a score. Mims got 171 and two scores. And Farouk got 134 and two scores. And Braden Willis with his one catch for a touchdown. And with that performance, we finally see Dylan Gabriel on the Heisman watch list. It took a six touchdown performance to get him there. And now in week seven, our next game will be against the Texas Longhorns in the Red River Shootout. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys next time.